Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's nice to have you guys back. And in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how I did this beautiful, flawless makeup tutorial without using a foundation. So this is the product that I use. It's a total coverage that I use to achieve this flawless skin. So if you're interested in finding out how I achieve this without using a foundation, so please continue watching. I will be using my Makeup Revolution eyeshadow palette, but this time I decided to use two different palettes because I'm trying to get different shades, which are just not in one specific uh, palette, so I'm deciding to use two. So basically, I am getting started by applying my eyeshadow deep into the crease, as you can see right there. and. What I'm trying to create is just something like a bit pink, like purplish, like brownie, like just kind of pink eyeshadow. So guys, I know I've been a while that I didn't record or didn't post anything because I've been so busy lately and this is the second palette that I'll be using because here there's much of that kind of pink that I'm looking for and it's kind of like dark i'm like trying to make like a dark pink you now the brighter and yes so guys if you're actually new to my youtube channel please don't forget to subscribe please hit that button to subscribe to my youtube channel i would really appreciate that and for my subscriber welcome back and please if you like this video give it a thumbs up I'm not really a fan of uh, too bright eyeshadow, but today I decided to go out of my zone, like to create something a bit like brighter. But it doesn't look much pink, it looks a little bit like kind of purple pink, if I would say. And to brighten up my eyelid, I'm using uh, like a light shade, like it's, a, it's much more like white. Uh, color that I'm using like to just to pop up my my eye read as you can see right there and that's it I'm applying my mascara and this is the product that I'll be using as I said uh, the, the the title video that I'll be not using a foundation like I said I'll not be using a foundation so this is what I will be using to apply on my skin it's quite light like if you put it on your skin it, this coverage is like light it doesn't give you that kind of like um it doesn't give you that foundation so much like small liquid or more wet treat it's much more like very flawless and it's really matched to my skin color like it sits so naturally on the skin this is doing a great job. I've been using this for longer. I remember <laughs> this was my favorite kind of like coverage that I just apply all over my face and not putting any foundation on top and that's it. I just do it like that as you can see in the video. And it's really covering up like you see on my forehead. I have a lot of blemish. But if I just apply this, it's totally cover up everything. Like, wow. Be honest ladies and gents this is a miracle worker like it does wonder <laughs> i really really love it and when i just apply these a lot of people like where i go like, like what kind of foundation do you use i get a lot of questions and compliments about that. what type of foundation do i use but that's what i use the foundation and now i'm going in with my uh can stop one stop from nyx cosmetic i'm trying to um highlight let's highlight 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 this is my favorite part this is my favorite part and i'm going in with my makeup uh this is from makeup love Evolution um, concealer and it's a it's much lighter than the other one from nyx uh, product one i use first and it just give much nice extra light under the eye there because i would love really everything to look like voila so cute and i'm just using my 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 
beauty blender from makeup revolution i'm using this just to blend in my concealer and guys the key to beautiful makeup it's blend blend that concealer girl blend it into your skin blending is one of the important part and for contouring i'm using again a, con a, a contouring um Concealer from Makeup Revolution. Oh, I just realized I'm using a lot of product from Makeup Revolution. <laughs> so I'm using this kind of liquid contouring from Makeup Revolution concealer. I love it, guys. It really do, does wonders. It just do everything nice. It really contours everything there. I just took the darker one and it does wonders, as you can see. It's really cool. It's very good for contouring because uh, I don't think I like the powder I, I like to use a liquid contouring foam first and then later a powder like for bronzing my cheek and to set my concealer under the eye there I'm using my favorite setting powder from high-tech makeup and I don't use a lot because I'm trying to make it not look so cakey and more more powdery so i'm just trying just to highlight the places where i use the concealer just to make sure that everything is so smoothly i don't have any blemish showing up or any kind of like cakey stuff you know what i'm saying and i give it a little bit of there down my cheekbone just to to shape up my face so i'm using now the this one, I don't remember where I bought this kind of bronzer powder that I used to contour my cheekbones. I don't remember where I bought this product. Oh, I think it's from F Fit Me, something like that, but... Yes, and that's it. And I'm using now, just, I'm just, just dusting off everything now, all the powders, just to make sure that I don't have any remaining powder flying over my face. Girl, what do you think? Please, if you like this tutorial, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Comment down below the description box what do you think about this tutorial. Do you think it's good? Do you think I nail it? Do you think I don't nail it? Give reasons why. And I'm going in with my setting spray from Makeup Revolution. Wow. Give it a thumb up to Makeup Revolution. This is amazing and to highlight my face wow seriously guys i'm in love with this this highlighter it's from high-tech makeup and it just does wonder to my face it's kind of like shimmery natural shiny and i put a little bit of on top of i mean there under my eyebrow and a little bit on my nose And for my lip, I'm using my lip liner from LA Girls in a brown chocolate color. That's what I used to, to line up. And I'm using a lot of different uh, lipstick and lip gloss because I'm trying to achieve a lip that will match with my eyeshadow. So I'm just trying to play with many different type of uh, lip gloss and lipstick just to lighting up and voila that's the end tell me guys what you think i'm in love with this look i love the outcome there was no foundation used as i said and that's it the skin is flawless everything is shiny and it's so beautiful i love it so please don't forget to subscribe i keep on saying this many times but yeah that's it that's a quarantine makeup tutorial that i did for my living room <laughs> i would say because i had nowhere to go but i film it for you guys much love thank you for watching and see ya okay that was your girl princess queen v thank you very much for watching really appreciate this so please don't forget to comment down below the description box what you think about this tutorial so and give your opinion what you'd like me to film on my next video so thank you stay home wash your hand ciao ciao